What is up YouTube? It is Onion Bomb here. Welcome back to another South Park reaction video. Today we are on episode 17 of season 2. <laughs> I'm not an elf. I'm not a goblin. I'm a gnome and you've been gnomed. No, you have not been gnomed. This is a South Park season 2 reaction, but the episode is called Gnome. What is South Park gonna do with gnomes? I don't know, let's find out. Probably nothing good. <laughs> Probably nothing good. Last episode was a second Christmas special. We gotta see Cartman's family. And unfortunately they did not give Kenny the pleasure of living like they did the last time. So I don't know if we'll ever see Kenny live throughout episode again, but maybe got delayed. Maybe it's this step that this is probably not the episode. Let's get to it. The school board is considering firing me as your teacher. What? Again? There's oh, yes, no. Stanley. That's okay with us. Yeah. Yeah, we don't yeah, care. Thanks. No, it isn't. It makes you very sad. <laughs> now, apparently, the school board thinks that I don't teach you anything about current events and come up with something current in South Park to do a report on. <laughs> oh, I hated these projects. Like, current, like bro, like, is, is there even anything going on right now? <laughs> like, when I, that's what I was feeling. Wendy, Bebe, Clyde, Pip, and Token, you'll be group one, and group two will be Stan, Kyle, Eric, Kenny, and, and Tweak. <laughs> no, not Tweak. We don't want to be Tweak. <laughs> he looks like he's tweaking. Great job in your group. I can't take that kind of pressure. Right when he went to talk, my headphones said, like, battery low. <laughs> and... Oh, sweet Jesus, Wendy. Dude, we can't work with this kid. <laughs> <laughs> I'm weak how he put, like, the main four together, like Kyle, Kenny, Stan, and Cartman, and then uh, then they got Tweak. Oh, I paused it and look, there's a cafe called Tweak Bros. <laughs> Is that his his cafe? I guess so. We're zooming in on it. For you, large coffee, small coffee. Ha <laughs> ha! The small coffee, sixty nine cents. Ha ha ha! do is buy out your coffee shop here oh forget it my, my store is not for sale my company's prepared to make you a very generous offer this is a crimsonite briefcase all leather it has four compartments <laughs> the answer is still no mr poston you see when my father opened this store 30 years ago he cared about only one thing making a great cup of coffee <laughs> but i guess we just care a little more and that's why tweet coffee is still home brewed from the finest beans we can muster Yes, Tweet Coffee is a simpler coffee, or a simpler American. We're just going to have to open our Harbucks right next door to you. But that could put me out of business. You might need to just take the take the 500000 Sir Bar Brady? Who was that? Oh, uh, just some dong. What can I get for you? <laughs> the usual. <laughs> oh, thanks. See you tomorrow. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So let's figure out what to do it about. How about we do it on that Raymond guy on TV? You know, everybody loves Raymond. No, Cartman, we can't do it. Everybody. Current event in South Park. The gnomes. What? We can do our own. The gnomes. What gnomes? The underpants gnomes. The little guys that, that come in the room late, late at night and steal your underpants. Dude, that's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Yeah, I've never seen any underpants gnomes. They come out at three thirty in the morning. <laughs> Must be born up then. Mr. Garrison will fail us because you're making it up. Can't no, sleep at my house tonight. I'll prove it to you. Oh, hello, son. How was your day? That's good. Who are your little <laughs> friends? What do you mean? Where is oral report, buddy? One for you. Oh. How about doing a report on the how large corporations the take coffee. over little family-owned businesses? I had to take all my business, which means I may have to shut down and sell my son Tweak into slavery. Ah, slavery? Yes, slavery. Wow, that sucks, what? dude. My balls in a salad How'd you, how We're already you get doing there? The Wait, if he's Mr. Tweak, and they're calling him Tweak, is his name Tweak Tweak? Because he's tweaking that much? And this stuff is strong. It's kind of bitter. What if my parents go out of business? What'll I do? Don't worry about it. But we'll starve and die like dogs. Tweak, tweak, you can always go on welfare. Look at Kenny's family. They're perfectly happy being poor. And I knew that was coming. Like, what are you about? I knew someone was going to mention, like, Ken. when you look at Kenny, he's going to... Happy being poor and on welfare, right, Kenny? <laughs> you said Kenny. Well, <laughs> did he say, did he say fuck right, you? <laughs> I'm not sure if he said F you or exactly. Oh, yeah. Oh. Kenny, don't get too hyperactive. No, no. 
Oh my goodness, that's the fastest Cartman's ever moved. Uh. <laughs> oh, my stomach hurts. Oh. Yeah, mine too. I wonder why. Well, it's 3.30. I don't see any goddamn <laughs> underpants, gnome sweet. Maybe it was all in my head. Maybe I'm going insane. Oh, my oh, no, goodness. I'm going insane. Well, this is just great. We haven't gotten anything done and we're totally screwed. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh. boys, I, I don't mean to pry, but <sighs> if you want it, I wrote your report for you. You did? What? Yes, it's all about corporate takeover. <laughs> of course, you don't have to use it. No, we'll use it. All right. And it can be our little secret about who wrote it, right? Sure. This part first, all right? Big. Guys. Guys. Really, really play it up. The gnomes. Really, really play the sympathy. Guys. Like that. The gnomes. Really Please. Look. Just look. They're taking Tweak's underwear. Guys. <laughs> Yo, this kid, man. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. I just wanna... This one shot right here. Tweak. For the first time this episode. For the first time. Is absolutely just still. You don't even have to pause it. He is still. Every other time he's shaking, but he's still. So just enjoy this shot. I don't think they wrote this, Mr. Hand. Perhaps <laughs> Boys, it's obvious that you didn't even... Great job. Yes, great job. Boys, you have really opened our eyes. We didn't even know this was happening. Neither did we. <laughs> and it looks like we were wrong about you. You really are teaching these kids something. Well, I don't want to sound like a dickhole, but I told you so. Let's join them in the fight against corporate takeovers. Uh, Lead the way, boys. Huh? Uh, too much pressure. They really have my balls in a juice maker. Oh, hello, son. Uh, how did your report go? I think it went really good. Sunrise or a juniper, wet with dew. A light rain in the middle of dusty afternoon, or a hug from your dear old aunt. Dad, what? The metaphors, man. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> the <laughs> metaphors. This committee is not going to let you be run out of business by these bastards. You hear that? You're not gonna get away with this. <laughs> we want you to take your case to the mayor. Our case? Oh. Uh, no way, man. That is way too much pressure. Yeah. If not for these boys' excellent report, you're telling me that students from Mr. Garrison's class actually did something that had some kind of relevance <laughs> to the world? That's right. They might have saved Garrison's Mr. Garrison, job. The guy with the puppet. Yes. Well, I must say, Garrison, <laughs> perhaps you're not as stupid and crazy as I always tell people you are. Thank you, Mayor. Boys, we're gonna pass a law. Uh, hooray. Oh. And things like that, and then the elves. Have a vote in the middle of town, and obviously if more oh, they're just taking it off of people? And care enough. Didn't you see them? <laughs> Sing underpants. Is it cold? Oh. Uh, boys, <laughs> can I with you? Boys, I don't know who wrote that report, but now that you've convinced everybody, you better stick with it. Because if these people find out you didn't really write that paper, and I actually do get fired, then Mr. Head is going to do horrible things to you. <laughs> oh, not that, Mr. Head. That's really <laughs> Anyway, good luck passing your new law. Why, why is every time someone writes something for them, it like... It, they they either they can't either just get away with it or get caught. It's always like has to be some some big thing. Like when uh Cartman had had that essay, I forget what happened. Either like I forget it either got switched with Wendy or like he cheated it somehow and like and like it had like that one woman came. I forget names, <laughs> but Garrison tried to like shoot her. I mean, I guess it only happened twice, but I, 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 other times, like, when some people, like, like, fake an essay, it seems, like, stuff like this happens. It just goes too far. Starbucks is an organization that, <laughs> an organization <laughs> that prides itself on great coffee. We simply, What's your thoughts? Oh, they have to do this. Come on, boys, don't be shy. What's oh, your principal no. argument? Uh, uh. This guy sucks ass. Yeah. <laughs> Great argument. You win, boys. What? <laughs> that was close, Mr. Hand. Say about top ten. I don't like big corporations. I like small businesses. I believe in the family-owned enterprise. <laughs> I have no it's idea what he said. It's time to stop large corporations. And tweak to yeah. Top ten. Or else. Paid for by citizens for a fair and equal <laughs> way to get Starbucks coffee kicked out of town. <laughs> the big problem with this. What do you mean? We're just using those boys for our benefit. They have no idea what they're saying. 
They're, they got, you know, they got a grade out of it. They got a project out of that. I think it's a beneficial give and take here. Your coffee tastes like three-day-old moldy diarrhea. Well, I'm sorry to inform you this town is having a vote tomorrow. What? Five o'clock, the best coffee wins. Either your coffee or Tweak's coffee. Like an old sweater that keeps getting warmer with age. You can count on Tweak's coffee to start your day. Now. They're Wait. expecting you to give a big speech on corporate takeover. <laughs> where's, where's Kenny? Where's Kenny? He's not, he's not present. Where is he? Why is he in a position to die right now? Get your asses to work. What now? They're expecting you to give a big speech on corporate takeovers, and this time it has to last five minutes. Oh, God. Okay, can so you what do we do? So, wait. <laughs> so, a few episodes, episodes in a row there, I, I caught Kenny in frames after he died. Then he was just not there. When he did die yet, now you could, or, or this is an easy one, you could just say he wasn't there at the time, but everyone, even Tweak was there. Ever Kyle, Stan Clark, all three of them were there. Why wouldn't he be there? I don't know, something, something's going on. I, 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 I'm smif smelling something, like something's cooking. I, 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 in all honesty and fair, probably not. I'm probably just like catching these like, you know, Editing mistakes of like, like a, a twenty plus year old show, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I it, it's happening too much to not like set off the sus meter a little bit. I I don't know. I don't know. This one I less than like. It's more so like when Kenny appears when he's dead, but this one could have been an easy one. But I like like I said, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, they're back. Is this all in his head? Because how are they just not seeing it? Oh, no, they just see him. Oh, no. Don't scare him. Cartman, why? Where'd he get the stick? Is that all you got, pussy? Why? Hey, you taught me a pussy. You're a pussy. You think about business? Sir, that's what gnomes do. Show us. Okay, follow me. <laughs> you don't know what to... I'm gonna call me a pussy. <laughs> Dude, this place is huge. Yeah, it's almost oh. as big as part of ass. <laughs> no, it isn't, you guys. <laughs> I keep saying that too, but a, a big pile of underpants. Underpants are just phase one. Phase one collects underpants. So, what's phase two? Well, phase three is the proper. <laughs> phase one, collect underpants. Phase two. Phase two, <laughs> three, proper. No. I get it. No, you don't, fat ass. <laughs> you guys know anything about corporations? No. Oh my god, they killed Kenny. You got fit. We killed your friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look. We gotta know about corporate takeovers tomorrow, we're screwed. Just, they're just going past, you know, you know, this is our, like, 20th, 40th rodeo. So they're just, they're, just, they, they're too concerned about what's going on. <laughs> oh my god, I can't get any of Like, they know it's coming, too. <laughs> Lovable, innocent children. Minus one, Since but no one's so gonna notice. With the corporate takeovers, we went and asked our friends the underpants gnomes, and they told us all about big corporations. Underpants gnomes? Big corporations are good. What? Good. Because without big corporations, we wouldn't have things like cars and computers and canned soup. Starbucks coffee started off as a small little business, but because it made such great coffee, and because they ran their business so well, they managed to grow and grow until it became the corporate powerhouse it is today. And that is why we should all let Harbucks stay. I mean, they're not really like, like wrong, but eh, this is a uh, quite the one eighty, and like the the they're just probably gonna expose they didn't write the essay. It's not what you said last time. Uh, well, the truth is we didn't write that paper last time. <gasps> you let them turn. You <laughs> lied for the last time. <laughs> I don't mind. These boys are absolutely right. We've been using these poor kids to pull at your heartstrings for our cause, and it's wrong for even bother to taste Harbuck's coffee. Hey, this is pretty damn good. Yeah, it doesn't have that bland, raw sewage taste that Tweak's coffee has. Oh. 
Hey, hey, that is good. It's a French roast. <laughs> it's subtle and mild. <laughs> mild like that first splash of sun on an April morning. No hard feelings, Tweak. You know, we still need someone to run this Harbucks coffee house. I'm <laughs> sure we'll make a lot of money. Thank you, Mr. Poston, but I think we'll be fine with the money we make selling our son into slavery. <laughs> Bruh. <Thanks>, son. <laughs> <laughs> They're still taking the other friends. <laughs> What do you say? I love you guys. <laughs> well, I didn't expect that. The underpants gnomes convinced them my confirmation is good. I mean, as long as Mr. Tweak still has a job, that was kind of funny at the end. I was like, I thought I was under the impression that everyone liked Mr. Tweak's coffee. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> I guess that wasn't the case. <laughs> everyone, just, everyone just didn't want, you know, the corporation, the business. Not gonna lie, Harbucks clear parody of Starbucks. And I'm not a coffee drinker by any means. But, I don't know, Starbucks seems, that always seemed expensive. If uh, at least the, those damn like the cake balls or cake pops like like a cake ball on a stick they're selling that for three dollars. What? Three dollars for one small bite of cake? How bit? How much is like a whole cake? A multiple sir? I, I think it's like that crazy amount compared to like a small ball of cake for like three dollars. So I I don't know if. That is the corporation we should be praising, but uh, but yeah, fun, funny episode. Uh, definitely a, like a nonchalant Kenny death. I weak how like the gnomes are like, oh my god, they, we killed your friend, and they it's like, yeah, 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 yeah. First time we we've done this already so many times. <laughs> well, imagine that's like the start of like them just like not caring anymore that like, Kenny dies. It's just a slow like they don't even acknowledge it. Oh my god, you kill Kenny, you're a bastard. Like, like every, every time, like, like, oh, Kenny, bastard. <laughs> it slowly devolves. Hopefully not, because Kenny, at least, like, we, we can't even give him attention when he dies now. Like, he at least deserves that. But, uh, Tweak, Tweak's a new character. Uh, he was, I've said this four times already, at least, but he was tweaking. And he, he, he didn't seem like he was tweaking. But he wasn't tweaking, though. He actually saw the gnomes. Gnomes that steal underpants. They also have Mr. Tweak and, you know, Tweak's family. And, yeah, he's gonna be the coffee person now. They get to know more about a student in their class. I think in Wendy, Wendy and Bebe, I, I, I don't know if we, like, really got names for anyone else. I don't even remember, like, maybe I just wasn't, like, looking or paying attention. But I don't remember, like, seeing, like, like tweak. I, I feel like I would like uh, see a kid like just like shaking. But I was wondering about the gnomes, like uh, if like they were all in Tweak's head. But then like you know they stole underpants and like and the mayor said there's an underpants problem. And then the the one guy literally like he said, hey, hey did, 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 does it feel cold in here? And I thought it was here in Tweak's head, but then I I, I didn't get to theorize this because it, it like happened. Like, so quickly as I was thinking, like, Kyle saw him. I was thinking, like, you know, is this actually, like, Tweak taking the underpants? And, like, I don't know, we're, ju we're just, like, seeing it from a different, from Tweak's perspective. And that's in his mind. But, no, they were real, real uh, gnomes. And they were trying to make profit. But, uh, they didn't have a phase two. <laughs> they were, they had a po point A and point C. And they did not have a point B. And, you know... That's pretty important. I think you need to get point B before point C. <laughs> but that that was a uh, that was a pretty funny one. Um, hopefully Garrison doesn't get fired and we uh, yeah they, 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 we just forget about that. Cause I'm not gonna lie, as as weird as Garrison can be, he's he's funny. I I don't think anyone else could be the teacher. We had that one the one time. Uh, Wendy literally sent to the into the sun <laughs> and with that that brings us down to one more episode left in season two almost two seasons down at South Park really really enjoying this show and I enjoyed this season a lot as well um, I'm just I'm always excited to watch more 
and we're almost done with the whole series. Oh, only joking, only joking. <laughs> we are, we are pretty far from that. But I think you know, there, this does have some consistent people. I do be looking at the comments, and I see like you know some familiar names. So I thank you for all the support. Thank you for watching, and uh, yeah, you know, I'm, I may you know for the long you know the amount of this series has, I may not upload like a crazy amount consistently like always. Like I, I, I low key should, but you know just you know, with other things I have to do and other things in you know, other reactions I want to get out. I just I at least at least try to get this out like once a week. Um, and I know it's a, it's a, definitely a quicker you know quicker process than some other things between the recording and editing. Uh, just because South Park's only 20 minutes. I think I may have said this before. Uh, so I, I do, you know, maybe try to like up it. Um, but like I said, just have some other things I uh, want to get, uh, get going. Um, but yeah, thanks for regardless sticking around and stopping by. And hopefully you're excited for more like I am. Yeah, I appreciate everything, all the viewership. Thank you very much. For now, though, that is going to do it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like or dislike. Subscribe or don't subscribe. You know, it's always up to you. I'll see you guys in the next video. You watch with me. Protect your underpants from the gnomes. Good boy.